This is The Bottom Line. The Bottom Line on 938 Live. Now, it's a month away from Christmas and retailers are ramping up their marketing efforts to drive sales. This year, major retailers are putting in more effort to dress up their online stores in anticipation of a surge in consumers. Travis Teo reports. To beat the queues this holiday season, more consumers are going online to buy their Christmas gifts. Departmental stores such as Tanks, Robinsons and Isetan have already pushed out their online Christmas catalogues earlier this month. Tang Singapore spokesperson Jocelyn Teo says more money has been put into their e-commerce strategy this year. It's a channel that is quite new and especially when we're looking at our, uh, the way we plan our marketing strategies now, we are putting a lot more effort into digitization and making sure that um, the customers that are actually very, very mobile savvy or very tech savvy should be satisfied in the same way as they are in our store. So one thing we know what our customers want when they're online is that they're looking for items that uh, will be delivered to them. So for us, we're working closely with our merchandisers and our delivery guys to ensure that whatever that they order online, like gifts and hampers, all that will be delivered to them in a timely manner. Adobe Digital Index, which analysed 20 billion visits to e-commerce websites a year, predicts that online sales in Singapore will jump 15% this November and December compared to last year. Its managing director for Southeast Asia, Stephen Hamill, says online sales this festive period is double that of a non-holiday period. Singapore really is embracing digital. So we kind of see it as part of the bricks and mortar experience. So it's not like one or the other. We see that it's an omni-channel experience and the consumers are looking for digital to provide them with the intelligence that they need into pricing, into product comparisons and so on. And part of that overall experience now, since it's available to the consumers, is something that consumers are relying on heavily. Country manager for Visa Singapore, Ui Hui Ting, says the online experience is spilling over to the mobile space. So, well, you know, the growth is tremendous, but the opportunity is actually even uh, higher because we noted that in addition to the shift in terms of spending on plastic to online, more and more customers are also shopping using the mobile devices. In Singapore, we know that 26% of Singaporeans actually shop online at least once a week. In fact, during our recent survey, 48% of Singaporeans have used their mobile devices for online shopping. But Ms. Ui adds that there are still some barriers to overcome. One of the key pain points for shopping is actually the online checkout experience. And in various surveys that we have seen, the abandon rate can be as high as 68%. And when we uh, asked our Singaporeans to shop online recently, actually 38% of them cited that convenience is one of the key factors when choosing which site to shop. Um, so I think the checkout experience continues to be a very important factor. To address that need, Visa says it has a one-click solution which requires a password at checkout instead of keying in a 16-digit credit card number. Now, if you prefer to do your festive shopping while seated on your sofa, Adobe's Mr. Hamill's advice is that it helps to make your purchases early. The predictions that we're making is that the peak of uh, online shopping would be around about the 8th of December. And this is as shoppers hunt down the best deals and place their orders to make sure that they can still get uh, delivery before Christmas. The bottom line is brought to you by Turkish Airlines, Europe's best airline.